channel welcome back to mass effect everybody so we are back where we left off exactly last episode we're gonna talk to matriarch benazia of course like her mother so the plan is or we romance her and we rule the galaxy together forever or we shoot her in the face so those are two arc outcomes so it can go either way I'm gonna try the first one, but if that won't work out, um, sorry Tali, but, oh. Know the privilege of being a mother. It was only two steps further, okay. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. What? Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. Why are her tits falling out of her dress, almost? Um, I'm gonna be very aggressive here, okay? I'm not gonna... or maybe not. Mm. Whatever is not a good answer. Oh, okay, I'm gonna say this. Is here because she wants to be, not because I asked her to. Yes. Indeed. What have you told him about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? Yeah, nothing. That you're insane? <laughs> Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. Uh, you can take me. So smug with a hole in your head. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Oh, that's not. Maybe I shouldn't have been so aggressive. <laughs> what? Oh no, Liaras! More Liaras! Wait! That's no good. Wait, 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 wait. Jesus Christ! What should I do here? Liara! Wait, are you the real one? No, you're the fake one. <laughs> you're the real one. <laughs> she just casually stand behind, uh, next to me. Okay. Oh, okay. Geth, we know how to deal with Geth. That's fine. Well, where are they then? Oh, are they just standing there? Okay, um... Well, maybe we shouldn't have been so aggressive. <laughs> maybe if we talked uh, a bit more sense into her, she would have been different? Maybe not. <laughs> oh god. You guys are not having a great time, huh? The game is a bit loud when I shoot, but that's fine, right? You are, you are into the action with me, right? Wait, I thought Geth approached... Oh, yeah, there they are. This sniper is so fucking good, I love it. What even are you? Are we gonna need to fight you? Probably. Is that it? That's not it. That's it. Okay. They're all arriving by train. How lovely. What? What? Why is she spazzing him? Spaz? 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 Spazzing him? Minging out? I know uh, what I wanted to say. Come on, that's a hit. Whoa! Jesus penis! What? Jesus penis? <laughs> Can we take her or... Oh. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, damn it. Come on, show yourself. You're the last one alive. There we go. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. <laughs> My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. Your troops are sloppy. <laughs> no, no, no. What's what's Saren planning? I want to know. I want to know. Come on, talk. Betray him. You will. 
You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Uh... Why are you able to break free of his control now? I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination, saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. What? It will not last long. I don't believe you. You chose to join with Saren. You just got more than you bargained for. It is a terror to be trapped in your mind. To beat upon the glass as your hands torture and murder. I was powerless. Nothing but a tool for Sarah. Why do I don't believe you? Come on, man. Come on. The Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Since it's the location of the Mew Relay. Mew Relay. How do you lose a relay? What's a relay? How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise oh. vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the Nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space. What is this camera angle? Something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Uh, you have it? Can I assume you found the coordinates? Two thousand years ago. The Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the relay. Two thousand. I'm a bit late. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. I took the location of the relay from the queen's mind. I was not gentle. Um. How did the Rachni find it? They searched patiently. They are territorial creatures, driven to close any possible way into their systems. Okay. Why does Sarah need the Mew Relay? He believes it will lead him to the Conduit. Oh, okay. I would tell you more if I could, but Saren did not share his counsel with me. I was merely a servant to his cause. You have to give me the location. Give it to me. Give it. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take oh. it, please. That was easy enough. The relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination, but you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear, fingers on my spine. You should, you should, ah, oh, you should. Mother, I. Don't leave! Fight him! You've always made me proud, Liara. Is she, is she gonna kill herself? Oh no, she's not. Or is she? Die! Enter. What about no? Why can't I shoot? Ah, I'm frozen! <laughs> Come on! Oh, 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 I'm, I'm, okay. Liara is dead and I'm dead. I couldn't even move! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay, let's run away first and then aim. <laughs> oh, what? You will have to stop him, Shepard. Um. I'm not gonna say stay with us. The acting was subliminal. Subliminal of Liara. Um, treacherous words, you all there? You're free of the indoctrination again? I still hear it like metal on metal, squealing and reverberating. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. No life. They always said there would be a. <sighs> well, she's a she's a goner. Sweet, 
Is that what you have to say about this situation? Well, look away. Look away. Thank you. Just to make sure. Okay. <laughs> uh, that was it. Oh, what? What's this? Okay, let's check out the rooms. Like the. Uh, okay, maybe not. I can't go anywhere here. Well. Um, hmm. <laughs> Let's see what the um, what's my ugh, buttons? Oh, here we go. We should complete. Okay, we did it. It has been done. Wait, there's no th thing here. You defeated the veteran and leveled uh, hot laps. Depart rift station via the. Listen to the tram you arrived in. Okay. Okay. Oh, now it's this. Okay, let's find our way back. Or at least try and find our way back. Um, are we locked in? We need to find a back room. Uh, couldn't you stay alive? I said alive for two more seconds so you could point us in the right direction. Okay, uh, uh... Oh, we can go down there, maybe. I don't know. The music is very loud for me. I can't hear myself. Wait, I can't go here. Yes. Oh, maybe I can do a control thing here. Oh. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> oh no no no! Don't set it free or something. <laughs> Why did Liara lay down? <laughs> oh, I'm having too much fun with this. Why? Sorry, Liara. Oh no! Wait 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 wait! No 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 no! Oh, uh, I'm ready to shoot you. I I w I wouldn't have a problem with that. I'm glad I took her with me. This one serves as our voice. We can. Oh, that's not really a Riara. Not in Oops. these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Why aren't you? Filled you with enough plasma to pop a tank. <laughs> this vessel is at the edge. Yet, she struggles. You cannot see her magnificence. We are breathing on the embers. Um. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. Did you order your people to kill the science team? No, we were locked away here. The children are beyond our songs. They have been lost. I don't like my armor one bit. <laughs> you are not in harmony with those who hoped to control us. What will you sing? Will you release us? No, first, no. To fade away once yep. more. I will no. not. Those tanks? Acid. Strong enough to kill anything, no matter its biology. They wouldn't have installed that if they weren't afraid of the consequences of her getting loose. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. Ooh. You have the power. I'm going with Tali, 100%. I stand behind her. To the silence of memory. Uh. 
Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We hmm. were only an egg, hearing mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in this place. The last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. I can say I won't kill you. And just leave them, right? I think I'll do that. Although... I wanna go with Talis option as well. No! I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. No! Will give us the chance to go No no no! We will remember. We will no. sing of your forgiveness to our Damn it! No! Don't Duh. I thought the option was die, set them free, or, you know, I won't do it myself, you know what I mean? I thought, not that I was gonna set them free, I'm sorry, Tally. Tally, I wanted to go by your option, I'm sorry. Tally, we should have killed them. Liara, I will never listen to you again. Where is it? Is he gonna try and kill me now? Where did it go? Yeah, well, now I want to see it again. Where is it? Well, as long as it, as, as long as it opened my doors. Yes, it did. <laughs> nice. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna take. Uh, Uh, is it this one we need to, to take to go back? Can't remember. Central station. Yes. For sure. We did it! I don't like my armor. I really don't. But it's the best one I have, because... Um, well, apparently, you can't wear a heavy armor as the person I chose to be. Which is amazing. I spent all my money on Rex armor that I'm not even using right now. And spent all my money... Head for the Mew Relay. Actually, nobody asked. <laughs> no, but um, I spent all my other money on an armor I can't wear. Uh, not so fast. The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The commander is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the commander resign when I wasn't looking? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I won't be a puppet for the Asari. I give the orders around here. Understood? Forgive me, commander. I was only trying to help. It's okay. This is a tough mission. We're all on edge. Everyone go get some rest. Crew? Dismissed. No, 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 I want. Report is away, Commander. You want me to patch it through to the council? I wanted to be a bitch against Ashley. Damn it! Sorry, Liara. Uh, yes. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander, do not cut me off like that. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. And we're out. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, yes! <laughs> I'm really sorry. But kinda not, also. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> and they're gone! Oh god. Okay, let's go to the council. Can we talk to them there? <laughs> they're gonna be so mad at me, right? Oh god, let's let's go, let's go. Can we go to the council? Citadel? Here. <laughs> oh my god. 
Uh, I had to. I had to. Okay. Like, I know the reason I did it, because probably not a lot of people do that. And I I actually am regretting it now a tiny bit, because I want to know what they were going to say. I really want to know. But it was kind of really funny as well, so... Uh, yeah. <laughs> I haven't talked to them since I, like, cut them off back then and they were like, yeah, don't do that again. Whoops! Wrong button. I'm the worst. I'm the worst Spectre. Like, I'm not working with uh, the council at all. <laughs> they haven't heard from me in, like, I don't know, 10 episodes? <laughs> Oh god, this is great! <laughs> oh. Like, I could have say, said no uh, as well, but um... I just, I said yes, and I looked them in the face and said it, whoops. Interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. I don't like my armor, I need to go no. and buy new armor. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has okay, the deck. I want to go to the Citadel and see if we can, uh, or to the council or whatever, and see if I can <laughs> talk to them there. Because last time I went in there, I Kalisa Algelani recently attempted to land an interview oh. with Commander Shepard, the first human Spectre. Yes. Unfortunately, Shepard refused to answer questions, raising concerns regarding the Spectre's commitment to humanity. We'll have exclusive footage later today. Oh, I would love to see that footage. Um, okay, uh, so last time we went to the council, we couldn't talk to anybody there for some reason. Binary Maybe that's just Alex not... Has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. Okay. <laughs> so, last time we, we went there, um, we couldn't, like, talk to the council. I don't know if that's just a thing you can do, like, go in there and just talk to the council. Um, but, you know, I'll, I'll try and take uh, this thing. Uh, Citadel Tower. What's up here? Okay. Huh? huh? Three hundred years ago, the Geth drove my people into exile. We asked the council. Yeah, see, we can't. But they ignored our pleas. Can you talk to the council here? I feel kind of bad. <laughs> I really feel kind of bad. Damn it! <laughs> well, it was for entertainment purposes. Okay. Okay. No, maybe I would have done it. If I was playing on my own as well. Okay, let's just take check. What are you guys looking at? Okay, I can scan you, right? Scan! Boop! I got 2,550 monies from that? Jesus. Okay, well, uh, the council will talk to them eventually again. <laughs> um. Okay. Let's see what the plan is. Uh... Wait. Back, back, back. Exit. Let's see what the plan is uh... now. Vermeer. Find a conduit. We need to explore Ferus, Severia, and the Tennis Cluster, and Vermeer to find the clues that lead to the con conduit before Saren. So, this is the last mission, right? Do we start it? I mean, why not? I have, well, I know that people want me to do more, oh my god, all the side missions. Um, I want to, I want to find him again. I really do. Conrad Werner, so I can smack him in the face. I really want to. Uh, find Geth? Yeah, well, 
There are a lot of side missions, board. Oh, God. You know what? It's my let's play, and I want to do what I want to do. So I'm gonna go here, Vermeer. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Vermeer, Vermeer. Okay, let's go. We'll walk to. We'll walk to the um. We'll walk to my spaceship. Thank you. Oh. Oops. I'll talk to some people when I uh when I can. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> so... Wait, wait, no. Yes. Some people back there didn't like you, Tully. Oh. Many think less of Quarians for traveling in the flotilla and for creating the Geth. They see us as scavengers, little better than thieves. Perspective is a wonderful thing. Wait until their home world gets wiped out. Hey, no bonding, okay? <laughs> um, so I messed up in in the way of um, I never talked to anybody on my ship. So I thought I, I got a tip of like talking to my to to my companions. I thought they I thought they meant this, like talking like this. They meant like talking in my ship, but um hey you're back! Um and I I didn't do that. Which is not smart of me. Uh I could have gotten more missions and more background information and stuff from talking to them, you know, on my ship. Also, I had to do a mission with Rex or something? What was that all about? I had to take him somewhere. Damn it, Rex! And yes, now he's just shiny new armor. Okay, I'll go on my ship and talk to them. <laughs> Let's see what they have to say. Uh, that was pretty stupid. Oh, wait, wait. That was pretty stupid of me. Um, but that's something I know maybe for next game. In breaking news, um, Chairman Burns of the Parliament yeah, yeah, on yeah. Studies has been kidnapped oh. by biotic extremists. The biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades Gamma Cluster. No demands have yet been made. Well, that's another side mission. Um... So yeah, I kind of fucked up in there, in that way, but you know, stuff happens, shit happens. So let's go into our ship and let's talk to Tali. Prime, we present another profile in courage with serviceman Nirali Bhatia. A devoted wife and talented chef, serviceman Bhatia joined the Alliance military under the deferred education plan. <sighs> After finishing her service, Bhatia planned to open a restaurant. Instead, she gave her life protecting the colonists of Eden Prime. For more profiles in Courage, or to explore opportunities in the military, please visit the Alliance Military on the Extranet. Keyword, Courage. Extranet? Is this like the internet? But just like, outside? Yes. <laughs> We're back! Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in pro Nice. Ah, uh, yes, Hello. I'm out of those the awful suits. officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. You shouldn't get fatigued when walking into your ship or running into your ship. Okay, let's see where our everybody hangs out. Is, uh... Caden, I don't... Caden? Tally's not here. Okay. Okay, let's just let's, let's just look around a bit. Doctor Who? Yes, Commander. Is there something you need? How well do you know the lieutenant? I'd never worked with him before this mission. Oh. Ah. But he has an impressive service record. Over a dozen special commendations. Tends to keep to himself, though. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. L2? What does that have to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes there are complications. 
What kind of complications? A headache. Severe mental disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. There's a long list of horrific side effects. Caden's lucky. He just gets migraines. I should go. Okay, let's talk to him. Let's talk to him about his migraines. Oh, it's Liara. Hmm. Oh. If you are here to talk about Benezia's death, you need not bother. She brought it upon herself. Okay. In the end, maybe she's better off now. Maybe. She was a good person once. Before she was twisted by Sovereign's power. Better to remember her as she used to be. I blame Saren. And if I were you, I'd want revenge. We have enough reason to stop Saren. I do not need to add revenge to the list. Benezia That's chose true. her path, just as I have chosen mine. I am with you until the end, Shepard. About you. Tell me about yourself, Liara. Me? I am afraid I am not very interesting, Commander. I spend most of my time on remote digs, unearthing mundane items buried in long-forgotten Prothean ruins. You must get lonely. Hello, Shepard! Sounds dangerous. And lonely. Sometimes I would run afoul of indigenous life forms or stumble across a small band of mercenaries or privateers. But I was always careful. Okay. Until the Geth followed me to Artemis Tau. I never found myself in any situation my biotics could not handle. As for the solitude, well, that is one aspect that most appealed to me. Sometimes I just need to get away from other people. Why is that? Like other people? I suppose it comes from being a matriarch's daughter. Okay, I should have talked to them. This is interesting. <laughs> Damn it! They wanted me to become a Damn it! Of our people. Matriarch well, now I know for the next games, okay? Don't you worry. Don't it's you worry. The truth of what is yet to come. Maybe that's why I became so interested in the secrets of the past. It sounds so foolish when I say it out loud. It sounds like I became an archaeologist simply to spite Benezia. All children rebel against their parents. It's a natural part of growing up. <laughs> you share the wisdom of the matriarch, Shepard. That mm. is exactly what Benezia Hell said yeah. when I told her of my decision. But there was more to it than that. I felt drawn to the past. The Protheans were these wondrous, mysterious figures. I wanted to know everything about them. That is why I find you so fascinating. Oh, hello. You were marked by the beacon on Eden Prime. You were touched by working Prothean technology. I'm fascinating. Hello, Liara. Dissect me in the lab somewhere. What? No, I did not mean <laughs> to insinuate. Uh, I never meant to offend you, Shepard. I only meant that you would be an interesting specimen for an in-depth study. Uh, no, that's even worse. I mean, Liara, what's going on here? Down, Liara. I was only joking. Hey, I'm 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 Tali. I'm oh, I'm Tali. Dense. No, no. How could I be so dense? You must think I am a complete and utter fool. Yes. Now you know why I prefer to spend my time in the field, <laughs> disks and computers. I always seem to say something embarrassing around other people. Please, just pretend this conversation never happened. Uh Well, okay. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. Well, that was fun. Um Unless you wanna dissect me right here, right now, if you know what I mean. Okay, so let's find uh, uh, t t Tally, please. <laughs> uh, I have seen her before on the ship, right? I've talked to her. I don't know exactly where, but... Okay, apparently you can romance her in the next game. Which is... Which is gonna be priority one. For sure. No matter what happens. That's not the room I wanted to be in. Um, I think I need to take the elevator, actually. So yeah, that's gonna be priority number one, for sure. Uh, she was here, right? In, in like the engine room or something? Yeah, here. There we go. Hello! Hello, Shepard. Uh, like I need this. <laughs> you sound down. Your ship is amazing, and your crew's been really great to me, especially your chief engineer. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Chief engineer? The Normandy runs so smooth, it feels like we're not even moving. And the engines are so quiet. How do you sleep at night? 
It's too quiet to sleep. Silence wakes you up. Back on the flotilla, the last thing you want to hear is silence. It means an engine's died or an air filter shut down. Oh, interesting. I have to worry about that here. But old habits die hard. But it's more than just the silence. This ship feels so empty. It's like half the crew is missing. Hmm. Back home, I couldn't wait to go on my pilgrimage. I couldn't wait to get away from the crowds. Now that I'm out here, I kind of miss Interesting. It. Sometimes we don't appreciate what we have until it's gone. That's true. And Speaking bars, Shepard is. What the pilgrimage is really about. <laughs> it's given me a whole new perspective on my people and our culture. You know, there's always a few who go on their pilgrimages and never return. I always assumed something bad happened to them. But maybe they just wanted a different life. I don't want her to go back. I want to know more about the pilgrimage. When my people reach maturity, we leave our birth ships and seek acceptance with a new crew. It's necessary to maintain genetic diversity among the fleet. But no ship wants to accept someone who will be a burden on them. So, to prove our worth, we embark on a pilgrimage. We set out alone, leaving the flotilla and our families behind us. We only return once we have found something of value we can bring back to the fleet. Interesting. It's presented as a gift to the captain of the respective ship we wish to join. If the gift is accepted, we are welcomed into the crew. Can a captain choose to reject the gift? Uh, that doesn't happen often. Most captains are eager to increase the size of their crew. It increases their own standing in our society. Mm. Even when a gift is not particularly valuable, the captain usually accepts it out of a sense of tradition. However, there is a stigma to presenting a substandard gift. It's not the best way to make a good impression on a new community. Most pilgrims don't return until they find something worthwhile. I want to talk about something else. Uh, do I? I don't know. <laughs> See you later. Are you trying to get with uh, Tali or was it you? No, it's you, right? Something I can do for you, Commander. Personal questions. You name a class of alliance ship. I Wait, I. Served on it. Everything from I've asked this already, right? right? Down to frigates like the Normandy. My last assignment was on the Tokyo. Only a cruiser, but she was a good ship. Couldn't hold a candle to the Normandy, though. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, Commander. We should be careful. Uh, what was up with Rex? Okay, let's do Rex next. And then uh, that's gonna be it for this episode. Let's go. So, we've got Saren on the run. Yes, we do. It won't be long now. Saren's good, but I'm better. Good. He's rotten. <laughs> I could tell as soon as I met him. Why didn't you tell me this sooner? I would have if I thought it was important. I'll decide what's important. Now tell me how you know Sarah. This was a while ago. A bunch of murderers bragging about a job out near the edges of the Terminus systems. They said it paid well and the boss was never around to ride them. They said he was looking for more men, too. So I checked it out. I didn't know Saren was openly recruiting mercs. It wasn't that open, and he only showed his face once. We'd been raiding ships in the area for months when we took out this massive cargo freighter. Our biggest... Okay. Yet. I was on board checking bodies for valuables, looking for some extra credits. That's when I saw him. What did Saren want with the ship? I don't know what he wanted. He was just moving through the ship, watching. A couple of the mercs called him by name, but he never spoke to them. Never spoke to anyone. I had a really bad feeling about him, so I got the hell out. <laughs> Didn't even wait to get paid. That's the only time you saw him? Interesting. Didn't even know who he was. Still wouldn't if I hadn't joined up with you. But my instincts were right. 
Every okay. On that mission turned up dead within a week. Oh. Every damn one. So long, Rex. Interesting. Shepherd. Yes. Um. Okay, so he met. Well, met. Well, lucky he got out, so I could buy him armor. Whoa, what was that? Okay, so I think we're gonna start the last. Well, maybe not the last, but like the mission you can't. Like that's gonna be last, I think, in the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, I'm sorry, Council. I really am. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out the Discord if you haven't already and let me know how excited you are for the next episode. Not a cliffhanger like last time, but you know, it can I, I can't always get a cliffhanger, okay? So, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!